after Dr. Leg, played by Leonard Fenton, confides in Dot, June Brown, about Stuart Highway's, Ricky Champ, unsettling behavior towards him on EastEnders, Dot decides to confront Stuart. In last night's episode, fans saw Stuart turn even more sinister towards Dot's friend Dr. Leg. Viewers watched on as he looked inside his wallet and cruelly stole a photograph of his wife. In upcoming scenes, Dot will insist that Stuart packs his bags and leaves. EastEnders continues on Monday on BBC One at 8 p.m. But how will Stuart react when the only person who supported him turns their back? With Stuart's uncontrollable behavior seen on the soap before, fans could now witness the villain take things too far when his final supporter disappears. Could this be the end for Dot, or will the menacing character leave quietly? New spoiler photos show Dot and Stuart having a tense confrontation in the kitchen. In the pictures, Dot looks to be fearing for her safety and can be seen grabbing her bag to make a hasty exit in one of the snaps. In the second photograph, Stuart seems to be intimidating the pensioner with a leaning posture and fists that appear to be clenched. Could Stuart have finally lost all sense of what is right and wrong and off one of the legends of EastEnders? It wouldn't be the first soap death in January 2019 following Ray Kelly's, Sean Mann, murder. Fans are also waiting to see if Hunter Owen, Charlie Winter, is still alive after a confusing cliffhanger ending in last night's continuation. On Thursday night, Ray was shot dead by Hunter in harrowing scenes. Friday's episode saw him and his mother Mel Owen, Tamsin Outhwayite, burying the body before attempting to get rid of their clothes and the gun. The duo disagreed on how to approach the situation, and found themselves struggling to decide how to proceed. Their world was then turned upside down when the police arrived at their door to inquire where Ray had gone. When they eventually got rid of the police both Mel and Hunter embarked on their own quests to get rid of the clothes they wore during the murder. However, after previously claiming to have gotten rid of the gun, Hunter held it up to his nose and smelled the barrel. Meanwhile Mel rushed through the kitchen and haphazardly knocked a glass over, smashing it. As the glass smashed a gunshot sounded, however it was not entirely clear whether it was in her head, or if Hunter had somehow shot himself. EastEnders continues on Monday on BBC One at 8pm.